Hotels are now observed in different cities with its good accommodation and convenience. People would love to check in as much as they can do. Among those hotels, we will feature a specific hotel which is the oldest premier hotel and the first air-conditioned building at the same time. The Philippines' iconic Manila Hotel already celebrated its centennial anniversary 10 years ago. The beautiful California missionary-style building designed by architect William Parsons officially opened its doors on July 4, 1912. The first-class premier accommodation was the first in the Philippines and was the choice of the affluent tourists who visited that country. As part of the master plan of Manila, Parsons designed a hotel that is situated at the center of the graceful half moon of Manila Harbor, providing Manila Hotel a commanding view of the fabled Manila Bay sunset. It was an elegant edifice by the bay and through the years, Manila Hotel was the first hotel to have modern convenience known to man, including air-conditioned rooms, telephone lines, and the first guest lift to be installed in Asia. Since its grand opening, Manila Hotel has lived through two world wars, the formation of a new republic, the rise and fall of a dictatorship, and two people power revolutions, among others. A bastion of refined traditions, it is one of the few Philippine landmarks that has survived the turbulent history of the 20th and 21st centuries. Aptly called the address of the prestige, Manila Hotel has been the choice of world leaders, royalties, notable personalities, and legendary figures. Indeed, it was a hotel that made history. Among its most illustrious guests was General Douglas MacArthur, who made Manila Hotel his official residence and headquarters during his tenure as the military advisor to the Commonwealth Government of the Philippines. The hotel has also been the venue of lavish banquets for the members of the royal family, grand society balls, and milestones in Philippine government, including the Philippine Constitutional Convention in 1971. As what Ernest Hemingway said, the Manila Hotel is one of the most important landmarks in Manila. It presents a great story for the Philippines. It is the perfect representation of the city, if not the country's resilience, vitality, versatility, and hospitality. This is Armel by the way. Thank you for listening.